guys and welcome back to my channel in today's vlog i am going to do something i am going to fix my teeth so as you can see i have a lot of gaps i have an appointment right now at my dentist office that fixes teeth and i'm going to take you guys with me hey guys we just arrived in the netherlands i'm with my friend hi and we're on our way to the dental clinic oh my god i'm not even nervous i'm just like it's whatever it's whatever she's scared no i'm not <laughs> so we're almost there we're like an hour early but rather early <laughs> than late I just came back from the dental clinic and as you can hear I have a lisp because my lip is still numb from the, the anesthesia um, but yeah let's do a close-up don't mind my bottom teeth they're very very <laughs> they're very yellow compared to the upper and also my <laughs> is like as you can see I cannot smile straight yet but anyway so this as you can see it's just getting used to it because huh? <laughs> it's getting used to it because it's very very weird i know <laughs> feels like i'm wearing something over my teeth but i like it Hey guys and welcome back to my channel as you can see something new about me I wanted to answer some question about my teeth because I know when I was looking for information online I couldn't find a lot of information about getting composite bonding while having very large gaps in your teeth so here I am with some pictures and going to answer all the questions that you have first off first question is what did I do so I got composite bonding it's a high quality filling or filler I would say that they take and place over your teeth and then they harden it with the UV lamp it will last up to five to ten years and then I have to get them redone they are also a lot cheaper than porcelain veneers it's not the same the difference with porcelain veneers is of course the price not only the price but the duration porcelain veneers will last up to 30 years and also they look more natural than what i have done even though i think i, I like my smile and what else and also they shave down your teeth with the porcelain ones and i didn't have or i did have a little bit shaven down because otherwise it would be too bulky but not a lot like one millimeter <clears throat> went off my teeth why did I do it? I did it because I was becoming very insecure. Even though I overcame my insecurity by coming on camera and talking in front of the camera with my old teeth, I didn't start YouTube for such a long time because I was insecure about my teeth. I couldn't smile in pictures. And also I like laughing. So when I laugh, I really laugh with my teeth out. <laughs> and I had the feeling like it wasn't a cute look. If you know what I'm saying. So I got them done. I'm very happy with it. I'm not insecure anymore. Did it hurt? No, it did not hurt. Only thing that might hurt is the numbing of your whole mouth. I'm used to the needles, so I didn't mind it, except for the numbing in between the two front teeth. That hurt. Didn't hurt so bad, but it was a weird feeling. It wasn't a feeling that I was used to. How much did it cost? Um, it depends from person to person, so when you go, you might get a different price than I did. I got, I'm not sure anymore, so I think it was 175 or 180 for tooth, and I got eight teeth done. Would you recommend it? Yes, I would recommend it only if you need it. So for me, I thought that I needed it. I could also wear braces or wear braces, but... The chance would have been big that I still needed to get my still needed to get this done because I was missing two front teeth, uh, not two front teeth but two um, hook. I don't know how you say it in English, but 
I was just missing two teeth. So to make it a pretty smile when I got my braces off, I would have had done this same thing. So I was like, just skip the braces part. Um, I will just do it like this. I'm happy with it. Um, I would recommend it if you're very insecure about your smile and braces are an, an option. Otherwise, I would just go for braces because it's always better to keep your natural teeth, even though there's like a hype around all the world, okay, not the whole world, just the USA and the UK, <laughs> to get your teeth done, but please don't fall for the hype. Do not fall for it because it's not worth it. If you already have a nice set of teeth, if your teeth are straight, even if they're not straight, if your teeth are nice looking, if you have a nice smile, don't do it. So I would only recommend it if you're very, very insecure. I also got it in Hollywood White because um, I was like, if I have these teeth in for 10 years and they will turn yellow, I will be mad because I paid money for it. So I want the whitest of the whitest. But I had to bleach my bottom row teeth to match the above ones. Where did I get them done? I got them done in the Netherlands. I got them done at the clinic Apollo Tantelkunde. Um, they did a great job. I went in the first day to see if they could do it. He told me that he could do it, but that my teeth will be very broad because I have a lot of gaps and he's, he was not sure if he could close all the gaps, but he told me if he cannot close it, he will just leave some gaps in, in, in between my teeth and I didn't mind it. I thought, Ugh, at least it's not like what I have now. <laughs> he said it will look nice. So yeah, I was very happy that he could do it. So they did it in like two weeks already. It was very quickly. So then I wait, went in to get the mold done to get my teeth molded. And then the week after I went in and got the procedure done. So it was two weeks in total. Yeah. When I first saw them, I was in shock. I was like, what the hell is this? This is not me. Cause I was used to my gappy teeth for so long. My friend was like, Shana, this is not you, who are you? It was so weird and my lip was like very thick. Like I got them done. <laughs> so in the beginning I wasn't really fond of it. I thought they were too big, too bulky and I wasn't used to getting used to it. I wasn't liking it. But when days went on, I was like, yes, <laughs> that's what I wanted. That's what I like. So right now I'm very happy with it. That's it, I guess. Yeah. So you guys, I hope you like this video. I hope I shared information with you that you guys didn't know yet. Make sure if you still have questions, just leave them down below and I will for sure answer them. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.